My health physically, mentally was was really, really terrible. Being bullied as a teen and developing depression and anxiety, Lethbridge artist Jade Oshesky is recalling some of her darkest days. I developed an eating disorder because I just, I took it all on. Like I blamed myself. I thought, how could this be happening again? Like it has to be me. Oshesky says as the years went on, her health got worse and eventually was diagnosed with myofacial pain disorder. Kind of like fibromyalgia, but it's like, you know, invisible pain but like even some days just like putting clothes on and barely touching my skin would would hurt. Making the brave decision to leave a toxic marriage not only for herself but for her son. Oshesky says it was at the start of the pandemic she wanted to reclaim her life. I finally had a chance to be happy and um, to have a good life and to just I felt like I was finally free. Now doing what she loves again, Oshesky is sharing her story through her artwork. It's, it's just, I guess, a tool that I have used to said, express myself and connect. I just saw like an ad on my Facebook newsfeed that was like, hey, we're um, accepting applications for Whoop Up Days. Oshesky is set to be a featured artist at this year's Whoop Up Days with her very own booth. I've always sold my art or done events, but... Um, not for this and at this like point in my life. So it just seemed like an exciting opportunity. She adds she's most looking forward to sharing her story and connecting with others through her art. It's gonna be fun. I'm gonna be able to meet people, you know, new people and talk to them and I'm gonna learn from it. For Bridge City News, I'm Angela Stewart.